Hmm. Maybe we should go uh, stock up before we <laughs> go up here. Vending machine. Salt's uh, not that expensive. Actually, you should get yeah, it. <coughs> Figures. Um, the new one I got. Send for less. That's pretty expensive. Adds ability to ability to absorb and collect ammo. That sounds so legit. Both of those sound good, and I don't have enough for both. I'd ask you guys which one to pick, but um, I wouldn't hear back while I'm playing, so that's pretty pointless. I'll just take for less. Hold my shield for longer. Beyond that gate lies Comstock House. This one? Yes. Okay, how do I open it? Lady Comstock, how lovely to see you! Wonderful of you to make the journey, especially considering your painful death 19 years ago. Lady Comstock? The dress. The thing has mistaken me for my mother. Your fingerprints do not seem to be your own today, Lady Comstock. Are you unwell? This isn't going to work. I think it can. Your mother's dead, Elizabeth. Yes. I think it's time I paid my respects. Let's head to where she's buried. Alright. Time to go grave robbing. Don't know where that is though. Picking. Really? That little old lock. It's done. Traded three lock picks for $151. Uh, There's the graveyard. That's not half bad. Feeling. What are we looking for? Shotgun. There it is. I'm gonna go get the shotgun. Oh, it's only a one-time thing. What's this? The burst gun? No. Get the feeling we're gonna have one of those fights here. So, I don't care. I want this shotgun. No. Okay. And I can pick up the repeater. Uh, later. Why do we have to summon the lock if it's not locked? Why don't we just go in? Do it. There you go. Whatever. It's your mother's grave. They have her preserved in an airtight chamber. Her fingerprints will get us into Comstock House. She's your mother. A mother who abandons their child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door, or do I have to go in without you? Guess I'll open it. She's going down a dark path. I don't know if that's my fault or not. Elizabeth. It's her. How are you, mother? All locked up in there, huh? Looks like you and I have some common ground. Let me do it. No. Let me do it. Yeah, get out of here. Uh. You see, child? You chose to follow a 
false shepherd, and he has led you astray. I kill this thing? <laughs> Elizabeth? Are you alright? Where, where did she go? Hold on, you need to rest for a minute. No, I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth? Why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He, he used me to, to power that device. He opened up some kind of tear. Okie dokie. Now we have to fight ghosts? Oh man. How do you kill ghosts? Oh, I guess you just shoot them to death. Okay. What's happening? It would seem your mother is raising the dead. Yeah, no worries. Not the whole time. Thanks. Actually, oh my god, she's coming at me. Back up. I was gonna use my power to kind of like blister. I don't know why that even hurt him. I didn't absorb it. Either. What? I can't hear you right now. <laughs> Fighting ghosts. Leave me alone. Thanks. Oh my god, get off me. Is she dead yet? No. I need help. You could just give me some of that. I guess you can't shoot them until they're... I'm out of ammo completely? Great. How am I going to kill this thing? Look how much ammo I have to use. Die. I just punched a ghost. You know how cool I feel? We gotta do something. She's got rockets. She's got rockets. I killed her. I did it. What am I? What? Oh my God. Is she the source of my power? But what is she? Alive or dead? Why do you ask what? When the delicious question is when. The only difference between past and present is semantics. Lives, live, will live. Dies, died, will die. If we could perceive time as it truly was. What reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all, Lady Comstock exists across time. She's both alive and dead. She perceives being both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Perception without comprehension is a dangerous combination. Look! Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her. Convince her to open the gate to Comstock House. I never thought I'd fight ghosts. Do it. There. I'll take that. The shotgun thing's back. What? It's a shame you have need of her to enter Comstock House. Frankly, she doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Hmm. Well, they're sarcastic. Something off about Lady Pump 
saw. Yeah, I noticed. No, you don't understand. She... she doesn't belong here. I brought something through. I'm just... I'm so sure it was her. Okay, I hear the little whispers. I don't think we need all that right now. Okay, I'm on. You hold on to this. Wait, what's this way, right? That's all I have. I missed. Oh, I just died. I didn't um, go exactly. Who are these people? She's like dead. Actually, really liking that ability. Done. Let's listen to this. Comstock seems to have been made sterile by simple exposure to our contraption. A theory. Just as sexual reproduction can de-emphasize the traits of each parent, so goes the effect of multiple realities on our own. Your traits dissipate until they become unrecognizable or cease to exist. What did you mean before when you said Lady Comstock didn't belong here? She's almost pale. It's like she's a reflection. Oh. I don't know. I don't know Found either. Some money. Want it? All right, hold on, Uno.